Welcome to the demonstration of ClickSite AI. I'm going to show you how you can rapidly build websites without writing a single line of code. So straight away, I'm going to go before your very eyes and build out a website. So simply once in the dashboard, we select create site with AI. Okay, now we have the AI website creation chatbot. Okay, that's going to help us build out our professional website. So straight away, it's asking me what type of business am I building? And now from uh, this drop down, I can select from a range of different businesses. Okay, like a beauty, bike mechanic, car detailing, cleaning, church coaching computer retail retailing content writing and the list goes on or i can actually put in my own custom business type now i'm going to go for barbershop so i'm going to already put the barbershop on there like so select enter and the chat box will take the information and ask me what is the name of my business now name of my business let's put it as mario's barbershop okay i select enter and now it will ask me what do i want this site to be about so i want this site to be about men's services well haircut for men's services okay uh, alongside that it's going to ask me what kind of language do i want so there is a multilingual engine built in this way it can translate the website into multiple different number of languages whether english spanish mandarin hindi arabic french russian and the list goes on for this uh, demonstration purposes i'm going to stick with english select enter and it will now create me an outline okay an outline of what the website is going to entail so i've got header about page and trendy men's for uh, trendy men's haircut discover the perfect uh, haircut revamp your look style services gallery testimonials call to action now all of these elements here i can actually delete i can add i can sculpt down and tailor make any way i want to match my own needs so i'm going to stick with uh, what it's created in terms of the outline select next now we have ready-made templates and layouts all ready to go okay so we've got a variety of different beautiful templates we can choose from um that all we'd simply do is select and we would proceed so for this let's go ahead and let's select let's go ahead and select uh, this template right here and it will start now building your website in front of your very eyes as you are seeing right now bearing in mind the images are also royalty free that will save you both time and money you're not gonna have to spend money finding appropriate images for your website and certainly you're not going to spend time scouring the internet trying to find those images uh, that you can use and that are congruent with your website topic so that's all ready for you and ready to go and alongside that you don't need to have any kind of expert copyright or spend money on copyright because the ai chatbot is actually building everything for you in front of your very eyes okay once the website has been created i simply now uh, i'm able to go ahead and edit you have a fully drag and drop website editor so anything from the text i can actually change i can edit i can customize depending on my needs or i want or desires whether it's for my personal use or for clients so here you can see i have the text i can actually change the color like so uh, alongside that i've got a preset number of styles and palettes uh, available to me i also have the ability using the editor tool we can actually apply gradients so we can actually change and customize the website uh, font any way we want uh, and then we can also highlight so uh, great tools again we can customize the text alignment uh, and even the style of the font we can actually change different styles of fonts just by simply one click now next everything that you see on screen is actually drag and drop i can move things around as i desire even with the background look uh, what i can do i can even customize the background different colors again using the styles and the uh, background colors and the palette or if i desire i can change uh, and add a gradient and customize again depending on my needs now another aspect is with the typography if i want to actually change the style of either a section or the entire page i can do so by simply selecting uh, typography and once i select it you can see there will be a change of all text throughout uh, this particular section or i can apply it to the entire page and another way you can also select is there's another host of a number of different typography styles i would simply select and you can see it will give me uh, a representation of that in this example uh, preview mode here and you can see that is now applying to everything now adding brand new sections we have some beautiful sections we can add i mean there's a whole host of different sections basics we've got different headers we've got sliders maybe you've got reviews maybe you want to demo your product your services we can actually put that on reviews testimonials we've got article sections uh photos maybe you want to put canvas there and maybe a carousel and you have all categories if that's what you want to do and all we simply do if i want to add a slider i will simply select and just like that you can see it has now been inserted into our website like so 
And again, I can rearrange, I can move, and I can even edit and change uh, the section itself. Uh, let's go to a header. If I wanted to add a header, I can actually simply select, and you can see now I have a new header. Furthermore, if I want to go a little bit extra, I can actually add a background image simply by selecting. Got editing tool, and I can select a background image. Now, we've got a choice. We can actually sell, uh, you know, upload our own image, or we can use the AI image finder. So simply I would select, and now it would bring up the AI image finder uh, where I have some of my own uploads, and I can now search. I can search media for uh, anything relating to haircut for men's. So let's type in haircut, and now it will go and get me images, uh, royalty-free images uh, for anything related to haircut, as you can see. And I will simply select, let's go for use, and it has now added that image into the background. Now, if I now return to the image here, I can clear that image. You can see that's now been removed. I simply go back into it. Now I can actually have the AI also generate images. So say for example, create an image for men's haircut. Let's go for that. And we can select different sizes, whether it's a scale, horizontal, vertical, and wide, and select create. And just like that, we have an image there. Again, this is all royalty free that we can use and that image has now been placed in there. Okay, let's close that right now. Next, we've got a great uh, aspect of content blocks. So we actually have ready to use design blocks. There's a number of presets you can use and everything can be edited and customized as you so desire. So say for example, in this example, you can see there's a beautiful drop down that has different aspects of these uh, content blocks, which are, you know, basic article headlines. You've got different buttons, so let's have a look. Here we've got some articles you can actually add. We've got different headline variations that can be customized and added. Uh, we've got uh, buttons, uh, another great one if you want to add those call to actions or uh, anything you desire. We've got contacts, uh, pricing tables, uh, you know, page not found, coming soon, FAQs. So everything can be added uh, simply by selecting uh, all well or from a click of a button. So say for example, if I want to add this button, I could just simply drag and drop that anywhere I want. And then you can see, you know, book a call where it may be. And you'll see how it just enters onto the frame there. Uh, another great thing, if I just go to basic, you can see if I wanted to add a video, let's add it like so. And then we can have a video then. We can actually select that video and actually add a video into our buttons. And then you know, if I wanted to add a call to action, I can do so. So we can add any of these components. Look, there's another little slider, an item. If I wanted to add a map on the coming soon, you know, uh, on the about section at the bottom, you know, location. These are things that I can add simply on the fly. Uh, we can actually add animations into our website simply by simply selecting. Uh, we can have different animations of fading in, how you want that to appear. We can even go a little bit more advanced. We can apply that different elements, columns. So uh, let's say, for example, if we just go here, we we'll simply select and you can see how it's going to animate. Uh, we can actually uh, animate how it's going to uh, enter into the scene on view, on scroll, on timeline, whether it's a fade, slide, flip. Like so, you know, we can select and preview how we want it to fade in. So you can do the whole section, the whole page, a particular text, anything as you desire. We can actually customize the timing of it um, and so, uh, so on and so forth. Okay, so another power feature is the personal AI assistant. Uh, simply select it and you'll get these number of prompts. So you can use the actual the assistant itself for design and editing. It can help create new sections, you know, design blocks, editing, designing, even the current section you're on. You've got content rewriting if you want to enhance anything, expand anything, then you can do this using the AI assistant. Okay, and even with the question mode, it can create you articles, it can condense those articles into bullet points, tweets, uh, content, whatever you need, it will do for you. And alongside that, we've got this command prompts section here where you can actually have these preset commands uh, that you can use on the fly and then sculpt them, tailor make them towards, uh, you know, uh, what you need. So, say for example, if you wanted to. Uh, have questions you wanted to ask if you've got general questions or uh, things on the canvas you want to change around you know create a feature list let's go ahead and select that i select uh, let's have a look uh let's have a look and then press send and it will go off and create uh this feature list and there we go it's created a feature list for us and then it's actually then create the content there as well i mean we can always go back in there um and we can change this text we can ask uh, the ai to actually change that content there and also we do have the ability if we wanted to to do ai rewrite so the ai here using these tabs can actually recreate content and also recreate the design of a section so you've got unlimited unlimited capabilities when using this okay and you can do this as many times as you want and i'll just show you one more example so there's a huge scope when it comes to um using 
the okay so add a block showcase in our ai powered innovations craft uh and an attention grabbing headline okay there we go okay so here we go uh, a block here ai powered innovations ai powered innovations uh with an image there and, and a call to action here at the bottom okay so these things again we can actually change we can use the ai assistant here to actually recraft this content make it more congruent with the theme of being a haircut we can actually add a link clickable links we can change the background and we can do a whole host of different things okay so hopefully you understand that this is a very very powerful uh, tool indeed and you can actually uh, narrate also so you don't have to type you can actually use a microphone if you want and just having this aspect here of these command prompts will make life uh, much much easier so there's a whole host uh, you can do using the assistant uh, so you're you're not limited okay when it comes to even content creation uh, design and copywriting okay so hopefully uh, you see the power of that and last but not least once you've done everything and you're actually happy with your site we can change different uh, you know devices we can see how it looks how mobile responsive it is and certain things we can change we can have it viewable on one device and not the other and then once we're happy with it we'll simply select publish and it'll be ready to go so hopefully you've enjoyed this very short video just demonstrating just some of the capabilities of click Science ai and once you're in the inside you will see how powerful this truly is when you're using it for yourself and creating your own website so i shall see you in the inside go ahead right now and take action